Well, hello there and welcome back to a brand new video where today's video is very, very exciting because today is the day, ladies and gentlemen, I will show you a comparison between Rugby 20 between France and New Zealand versus Rugby 22 against France and New Zealand. So obviously I posted a video the other day, which was the announcement, the official kind of gameplay, like I think it was like five minutes long of France versus New Zealand, two of the licensed teams in Rugby 22. And I thought, you know what? Why don't I try and replicate that in Rugby 20? Kind of show you guys a little comparison between the two. So the video you're about to watch, you'll see some parts from Rugby 22, some parts from Rugby 20. And yeah, the graphics might look a little bit different because obviously A1 is from a trailer, one is from me actually recording it. So it's going to be interesting, but hopefully you can kind of see the difference. I mean, I think the main thing we'll be looking for here is the mechanics, how people look, you know, how... The kicking looks, you know, the field and, you know, the mechanics of scrums, the lineouts, the kicking, the conversions, the tries and all that stuff. And I think that's kind of the main bit we're kind of like looking at. But anyway, enjoy the video. Let me know your thoughts, guys, down below. Will you be, will you, 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 will you be picking up Rugby 22 this Thursday? I will be. There'll be loads of videos on the channel. But anyway, guys, thank you guys for watching and uh, enjoy. Ben Kay is joining me for the commentary. Good to see you, Ben. Thanks, Nick. I'm delighted to be here with you at this match. Just time before the match starts to take one last look at the teams. How do you think they match up, Ben? It's fairly simple. If you look at the team sheets, you can see right away that they're stronger. The outcome of this encounter will essentially be decided by the intensity the players bring to the pitch. Still a few more moments before the match begins. And the kickoff goes to the left. Dupont beneath the kick. And a ruck is formed. And now for the first scrum of the match. Scrum in their own half. Excellent body position from the forwards who keep their own ball. The players flying in, adding their weight to this mall. Strong defence halts the mall's progression. They've held on to the ball. He was smartly placed to make that interception. Big tackle. He passes the ball. This is going to be a real struggle. And the score now. So, here's the first line out of the match. That throw's been intercepted. Wonderful technique in that offload. It's a ruck. They've managed to keep possession of the ball. A ruck's formed, and they keep possession. That was a poorly executed pass. They pile into the ruck. 
It's a ball that forces the opposition to turn and a kick that pushes play back outside of their 22. The ball's won back by the France pack. Oh, that is such a shame. They couldn't quite finish the job. Just needed that little bit of extra polish to work. Oh, he's got it out of the tackle. There's a rock being created. They still control the ball and can go wide. Gets his hands free in the contact. The attacking team keeps the ball. They really should be getting the ball out to the wingers. He gets back onto his feet to challenge for the ball. Oh, look at the energy, the dynamism of it all. Oh, they're really intent on keeping this ball alive. They could go on and score from here. There's the tackle. Here's the ruck being created. The penalty attempt next. This time it's not good. Too far right, so it remains 3 0. He passes it. The defence seems less effective out wide. What defence by Fiku. The referee says that's a rock and they keep possession. The tackle made, but the ball kept alive. What a break! An attempt at a tackle that went nowhere. They took the ball in and it's still theirs. They're passing the ball around well. And the referee oh. says that's a maul. Support for the ball carrier. We're approaching the end of the first half. They've organised themselves really well, ready to stop that forward movement. There are huge opportunities on the wings. They still control the ball and can go wide. Opportunity out wide. They needed the score and it's worked perfectly. What a move. Lining up the conversion to add the extra two. Ten nil. All right, looks like he's got his lucky boots on today.
help. Oh, 